viewers and welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Pearl Virgin. I am Gamer Sky. Last time we continued our exploring the extra areas which are required by Waterfall or Rock Climb. Today we are going to do that same and then moving towards the Victory Road because I think we just one route remaining and before I think Sunny Shore City that route is there. So let's see if we can. I think there is one spot for surf so we will be check that first okay let's get out of here okay so heavy thunderstorm is there i don't know why last time we came here there is no thunderstorm okay here it is the surf area okay we already explored this way i mean this way means these trainers so let's see if down is here anything. Nope. Let's see if anything is here. Okay, that cut areas. Okay, there is nothing special here. So maybe we can move now towards our new destiny. Oh, there is a surf area once again. Let's check. Just a Pokeball, okay. Oh, TM84 Poison Chap. Now what you are talking. A nice TM. Let's fly back to Wellstone because now we are going towards Sunny Shore City. And that middle. Let's buy a couple of Max Ripples though. We have just 14. So better way to buy before going any further. Okay, you are not selling Ripples. You selling repulse? Okay, thank you. Fourteen is there. Twenty-six will be enough. Thank you. All right, then let's move. I think that one will be the last route which remains to explore. After that, we can easily move towards the victory road. For now, let's go towards that route. Not in the patch of grass. Okay, let's use the repel. There we go. We still need to help that girl in order to find a key. For now, let's forget to help her and let's go towards Sunny Shore City directly. Not on the... There's no trainers, so there's no way this must be a trainer here also. Nope. Let's okay. I think we're stuck. So let's strictly fly, don't waste time. Let's go towards Sunny Shore. Alright then. Now we can move towards Victory Road finally. So let's get going. Jasmine is still here. Okay, route 223. Just a trainer here. Please battle me. So that way I can easily defeat you and move forward. So Lumanian, okay. Oh, level 43. Not a problem though. Let's go for Spark. I'm gonna do Victory Road in today's episode. But I think to get a nice TM, we need something like Trick or Pet. I think Dark Pulse is the TM there, or maybe Dragon Pulse, don't know. But I am not wasting time there. I will directly go towards the Pokemon League, defeating each and every trainer in the Victory Road. So that we can easily do the Pokemon League challenge in the next episode. Because you wait too much, guys. I told you just one episode. For the sea floor, seaside, seaway exploration, and it's converted into two. So I'm extremely sorry for that. But today, that's enough. Let's move towards the Victory Road and let's finish this ASAP. Okay, no more trainers here. Actually, that's a good thing. Okay, there is a trainer. I 
actually it's a good thing until we reach victory road there are not more than five six trainers which will be good mantic let's go for spark mantic is down Remo red no problem let's go for a spark once again man time this time let's go for a spark and there we go let's go to level 59 with that oh you must awake okay so let's do this doubles battle first let's defeat these two trainers quickly wow six pokemon thank goodness they battle with us in double battle i'm pulling on let's use spark on Meryl. use drill pack on Wingle. because Meryl is higher level than Wingle, so better way to use Luxray against a higher level Pokemon and use Empoleon against Wingle. 2 down, 4 more to go oh man, Quagsire and Golduck no problem use Spark, I will switch to Rose Red at least we can defeat one Pokemon at a time at least Golduck is down Quaxar is yawn on Luxray maybe You use Spark on Wingle You use Pedal, pedal Dance on yourself, okay There we go, Quaxar is down Let's go for Spark Luxray fell asleep There we go, I knew it. Next one is Pelipper and we need Luxray for that. So let's use Awakening if we have. Yep, we have Old Gatu, let's use it. It's like a full heal. Oh, Battle Dance, Battle Dance didn't done its work, so no problem. But still we defeated these double trainers. It is actually a good thing. Let's see if there's anyth anything here. Nope. I saw an item down here. If we go to okay, the way is blocked. Are you kidding me? Okay, we can go there by from here. Okay, so I just battle this guy first. Tentacruel, okay. Let's go for discharge. Which will give a nice amount of damage. And Tentacruel is down. We need a nice amount of XP, that's good. Let's get that item. Oh, how to go there then? Is there any way? Is there any way? Let's use a repel. I don't know if there's any way. Mm -hmm. Okay, there is a way from here. Wow. And definitely it's going to be a TM. Yes, TM in Rain Dance. Though we are not going to use it, but still. It gives us so much pain to find a route to come here. So you must be have a nice TM. We defeated this guy, so no problem. Let's move forward. There's one more trainer up ahead. One more here, so let's defeat him first. And go towards the lady trainer. Oh, Weasel, no problem. Let's use Spark. Oh, mistaken use Discharge, no problem. We can go towards the Pokemon Center before entering Victory Road, so no need. Tentacruel, now I have to use Discharge. 
Now I am using all by myself. <coughs> hey, please battle me, lady. Lady. Hey, lady. There we go. Battle me so that I can move towards my new destination, the League Champ. After crossing the victory road, of course. Let's go for Spark. Wingal is down. Last one is Seeking. Let's go for Spark once again. There we go. Seeking is also down. And we defeated the Swimmer. Let's move forward. Oh my goodness, still that much of road is remaining. I thought we have reached to the victory road. I'm so happy that we are finally reached in front of victory road but nope let's go for a discharge i think still maybe you want to defeat three four trainers or what lux level to level 60 that's the level i want actually to challenge the pokemon league level 60 so at least one of our pokemon reach that target let's go for a pedal dance There we go, Gastrodon is down. Next one the Machoke, let's go with Crobat. Let's go for Air Slash. Missed, no problem. Submission, not going to a thing because I'm part of Poison type. And with this Air Slash, Machoke is down with a critical hit. Though Air Slash has nice amount of chance to hit a critical and then flinch the opponent also. So we obtain a pearl here. There is no way to go there. So we have to go through here. Let's use Surf first and move up. Okay. This is the way. Still I see two trainers. Wow, so much big road. Let's paddle please. Gold Duck. She's using a gold duck. Let's go for spark. We are down the PPs now. Still that trainer is not stopping to come. Maybe victory victory road will have less trainers. This route is have more trainers than victory road, I, I can say that. Let's go for spark again. Pinion is down. Pelipper, okay. There is no Pelipper still use a protect yet, which is a good thing actually. Otherwise, if we are playing Emerald, then battle Pelipper. Definitely will use protect two to three times at least before your battle finished. There is no item down there. Just one trainer, maybe, maybe. Let's defeat him also. Oh, Gyarados directly. Definitely a final challenge. Using the boss of all Pokemon, Gyarados. Let's go for a discharge. There we go. Gyarados is down and we defeated the swimmer. There we go. We are at the Pokemon League. Let's go to the victory road after healing up our Pokemon here. Please heal up my Pokemon Nurse Joy. Let's see if there's there someone here to give us something. Like a present before entering victory road. Nope. Victory road ahead. Let's go inside. Let's see, Ripple is using. No problem. I'm putting Empoleon up in front. 
there's a rock climb area there I see trainer if we go that way so first of all let's defeat that trainer then we will go towards the rock climb areas oh not tall looks will be a good choice but try your luck and falling on air slash let's go for aqua jet knock towel is down store raptor let's go with luxray both have intimidate definitely yep let's go for a discharge don't waste time with spark because our attack power is already lowered by store raptors intimidate There we go. First one at least defeated. Full heal. Just an item here. So that's a good thing that we came here first. I want to use a bicycle. Let's use rock climb here. Okay. There is no way to go here. There is no upper head. Just a trainer. So let's defeat him and then move forward. Hunter. Let's use Surf. Hunter is faster than Empoleon. That's a critical hit also. Hunter is down. And Empoleon go to the 57 with that. Next one the Gengar. Not wasting time. Let's switch to Luxray. Have to use Crunch. Let's go for Crunch. And Gengar is down. Alakazam is the last one. Let's go for a crunch once again. And Alakazam is also down with ease. And Luxray will do 61 with that. That's a nice Luxray. Just an item TM41 Torment. Okay. So let's use a rock climb once again. That's a good thing that we are exploring this area one by one. We shall not get off track or lose our destination. So there we go. Okay, we have to go up. There's a trainer. Let's see. Ace trainer using gold duck. Man, I have to switch each time. Golduck is Screech. Let's go for a Spark. Though we lower his attack power, no problem. Next one the Blitzy, and we don't have a Pokemon who can use a fighting type move here. So let's go with Crobat, who can give a nice amount of damage. And also a female, so if Blissey wants to. Oh my goodness. Poison Fang do a lot more damage than expected. Next time, keep that in mind. If you are battling Blissey, use a poison type move. Let's use Repel. Let's go up. Wow. Uh, maze. Let's use Rock Smash to see if we can explore this area. Okay. Okay, there's a you can use bicycle up there, but still, let's defeat these trainers. And that's the way I think we can get the TM4 Dark Pulse. I will do that off screen. So let's at least complete all trainer battles and then move out. Maybe still five or six trainers remaining. Next one is a Carnivine. Let's go for a Fire Blast.
carnivine is down Rampardos, let's go with Empoleon once again Mold breaker ability, no problem, let's go for Surf And Rampardos is down And we defeated the Ace Trainer once again Okay So let's use here then use a rock smash then put up here then use a rock smash once again now we can challenge him or her two pokemon Clefable is the first one let's go for surf ok Teensy tiny damage. Let's go for one more surf. Torterra, okay. Hmm. Let's go Crobat. Poison type move will be effective. And his ground type move will do nothing. And even grass type also. At least with poison. Let's go for air slash. Synthesis? You're kidding me. Let's go for one more air slash, which is enough. To terrorize down. Okay, now how to go? Let's press this and press this, 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 this. Okay. And there's an old guy up here. Star Raptor. I need to switch to Luxray. I have to put him up in front actually. Quick attack, no problem. Let's go for a spark. Quick attack once again. No problem, still. He powered on. Let's switch to Empoleon. Sandstream ability, I knew it. Let's go for a surf. There we go. He powered on his town. We defeated another trainer here, though. Okay, there's a way which leads towards somewhere, but I'm not going there right now. Just use strength here. Last time we unable to go this way so let's check this area out okay is there a way or it's a trap oh there's a way I thought it's a trap but nope oh there's a way to get this pokeball let's use repel Doubles battle? Yup. Let's do this. Oh my god, it's Miss Cash. You seriously kidding me? And we have to switch. Let's switch to Rose Red. And you can use Spark on Star Raptor. Because if you use Discharge, you can give damage to Rose Red, but you won't do anything to Whiskash. So, better way to use it on Star Raptor only. Earthquake, which is effective on both. Hang in there. 
use pedal dance and you use crunch crunch is a backup if this guy survived the pedal dance but he's down so no problem at least we defeated both of them they just item up here so can we take it okay i think we need to switch gears okay i think we have to stop okay i stop right on time and tm71 stone edge okay okay i mistakenly use okay there are my pokemon okay I have got the full restore as well. I think we are explored everything here. That means just upper head side is remaining. And no need to use it. Let's smash it away. Like pieces. And there we go. Let's see if we can go there or not. Okay. We I think we need a momentum. Let's try it this one time. Okay. Okay, I'm not doing that. Let's go down. There's nothing, so we have to go that way where that old guy is there. So let's go that way directly. That's the only one to move through victory road. I will do that Dark Pulse TM in off screen because it gives me a lot of pain. So let's go towards that old guy. Okay, can't go there. All right then. Okay, let's use rock climb. Let's go to right and then up. He's a fighting type, so I'm putting Crobat up in front. Let's do the battle. This episode is going to be a way long, but I now have, don't have a choice. I have to cross the victory road in this episode only. Let's go for air slash, which will give a huge amount of damage. Crush Chop, it's a strong fighting type move but it's not going to thing on Crobat because Crobat is both flying and poison. There we go. We defeated this guy and let's go down again. Okay, now it's Surf time. So we need, I think, Luxrap in front. So let's keep him. I saw some trainers also. I need to defeat them before going towards that item, so let's get going. Jingling, okay. Let's use crunch. No problem, so opponent is a psychic type user. Chai Meko, okay, they will form. Let's go for a crunch again. Okay, there's a waterfall also and there's a down path also. So I'm taking the down path first. Just to confirm you that there is nothing. Are you battling me or not? Just running. Okay, then let's battle. Carados and Medichamp. For typings, we have Luxor and Crobat. Use Spark on Gyarados. Use Air Slash on Medichamp. There we go. 
go back go to level 56 with that and we defeated these two walls I think we have done enough for today let's explore this path rare candy okay I keep it take it I take it Let's go upstairs. Let's defeat this trainer at least. I think Victory Road is coming to an end. Because he mentioned Victory Road in its talk, so maybe we're at the end of Victory Road. So let's go for discharge. There we go, Hunch Pro is down. Alright then we have to use this waterfall to move up. There's a trainer and there's a waterfall again, so I'm using that waterfall again. In order to take TM59 Dragon Pulse. That's a nice TM. There we go. Maybe a last challenger. I don't know. It's a dragon tamer. So definitely a last challenger of today's video. Or maybe there will be some fun. Maybe we can get a rival battle before exiting victory road. I don't know. There we go, we defeated. Let's see. There is upstairs here. Let's use repel. Let's see if there's anything here. Nope. So let's go. So thank you guys for watching this video. Next time we are continuing from here. If you have any tips, any comments about how far the victory road is, let me know through comments. If you like this video, then press that like button. And if you are new to the channel, click the subscribe button and enjoy this let's play. Thank you guys so much for watching. And I'm going to see you in the next episode. Goodbye.